All right, welcome back, everybody, to Where in the World is Carmen San Diego? We are now Detective Artie, 23 Cases 1. We are continuing capturing all the crooks in the world from stealing Glad all the water. Back on duty. Are you Thank ready you, to Chief. tackle another case? Oh, yes, you, you know what. You know how I be, Chief. Troubles a brew in Guatemala, Gumshoe. Oh, dear. Someone stole the best coffee in the country. What? Those little brown beans mean a lot to Guatemala's economy. So you've got to get there and bring the good stuff back. And do me a favor. Bring me back a cup. Light. No sugar. Thanks. <laughs> All right, Chief. It might be cold after the plane ride, though. El vuelo 415 está a punto de salir para Guatemala. Heading off to Guatemala to find some coffee. Just a typical Wednesday night for Artie. But this time, we don't actually have to get on a plane in real life. And we don't have to deal with airport security. Hey, bro! Good day. Hey, where'd the suspect go? You mentioned an area where the large lungs of the locals are an adaptation to the absence of oxygen in the high-altitude air. Okay, that's weirdly specific. Her hair matched the dark circles under her eyes. Is that referring to black hair or gray hair? I don't know for sure. I will just mark that it's a woman. Okay, let's just take a look at the countries we can go to. It's not Iran, it's not Mexico. Could be Peru. Probably Peru. Peru has Tell a lot of mountains. Tell me what you need. I hear she's been smuggling stories for a reporter whose columns were canceled when President Fujimori implemented press censorship in 1992. Maybe not. When it comes to character and height, she seemed as low down as you can get. All right, she's short. Good to know. Hello, can I be of service? Yeah, can you tell me where they went? We were hoping to scale the summit of El Misti if the weather was clear. No, maybe that is Peru, because that is a Spanish With name. With that hair, she resembled a black widow spider. Okay, cool. Black hair. Hey there. Hey! Have you tried searching near the seashore in the Seichura Desert? I have not. She maintains a low profile around people of average height. Interesting. Oh, what does the note say? Taylor receipt taken in seen by six inches. A short job for a short customer. Yes, I know she's what short. What can I help you with? She professed a long-standing interest in visiting the University okay, of Marcos. Okay, it's Peru. It's Peru. The oldest college in South America. I tell you, her hair was the... Yes, yeah, so she's short and she has black hair. Oh yeah, season one of Arthur is an amazing start to the show. Honestly, first four seasons of Arthur are amazing. Season five is definitely a dip in quality, but it's still very good. Ah, you're so thoughtful, fairy godmother. Hello, stranger. Well, hello, dear. She's traveling on a train across the Nolarbor Plain in a first-class berth on her way to Perth. I'm not sure if it necessarily was bad when it went to Flash Animation, but it was definitely a bad move animation-wise. It doesn't look as good. Like, I still thought Arthur was, like, a fine kid show after a certain point. It just wasn't a great show that kids and grown-ups could enjoy at the same time. Her dew was darker than a moonless night. I know her about her hair. What do you need? What do you need? Well, I need you to tell me some She's stuff. She's traded in all her cash for down-under dollars. Oh, Australia! Her lenses made her look professorial. Professorial or professional? Australia's an option, right? Yep. Hello. Or, tell me about the suspect. She probably wins at Limbo. I know she's short. I want to know how fat she is. <laughs> what seems to be the problem? If someone bet her a pound of flash, she wouldn't be able to afford it. Cool, she's skinny. Here's our warrant. And now we're heading over to Australia. I always have to double check to make sure I'm clicking Australia, not Austria. Is now departing for Australia. Enjoy I the come to a land down under. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, some episodes are better than others. But hey, 
that is the episode that made me really appreciate Mr. Frensky. Mr. Frensky, best fictional dad, I would say. Do you need something? She was pretty slick, but I pumped her for information, and she let it spill that she planned to tamper with oil wells in Tampico. Tampico, eh? Could be Chile or Mexico. Hello, may I? They say a senora in Sonora gave your suspect her just desserts. Okay, doesn't really narrow it down for Do me. Do you need some help? She mentioned she was dying to find herself okay, a Mayan. Go. It's Mexico. And here we go. Buenas noches. Thank you. Hey, kitty. No, that was uncalled for. What? <laughs> the cucaracha intensifies. She wanted to explore the countryside north of the Kurish River. Don't know where that is. Don't recognize the language. What's on your mind? Oh, she made it very clear that as soon as she got to town, she'd go to the National Museum for a look at St. Stephen's Crown. Okay. We had that clue before. I believe it's Hungary. Well, that's because the Brain and Arthur were the only two, like... Brain, Arthur, and DW, I think, were the only free characters who were actually voiced by kids. So naturally, they had to get new actors as their voices broke. Do you need information? Yes, I do. She heard that the living conditions at Henry VIII's palace were pretty luxurious, but not worth losing your head over. Okay. So, United Kingdom? <laughs> Flight 324. Henry VIII is, is now it's pretty obvious. United Kingdom. No, we were talking about the Henry VIII in Saudi Arabia. You didn't know about that one? <laughs> I did not. Okay. Dumbledore, enough with your bowling ball. Why, hello. Hello. As a confirmed fan of red meat, she had a beef about going to a country where cows are considered sacred. <laughs> a backyard baseball show? I could get behind that. Okay, folks, we're going to India. They stole the coffee and brought it to India. And they left their cat behind! Alright. She is short and thin with black hair and glasses. There she is! Oh, yes? Uh, you're under arrest. Okay, I didn't think you needed to bowl her over. She was being polite, but alright. Penny Pincher sent up the river. <laughs> Best coffee of Guatemala. <laughs> to coin a phrase, I didn't think you coppers had enough sense to catch me. Dude, that was three puns all in one. That was beautiful. Great work. You've hit the headline. You pinched Penny Pincher and parked her parsimonious posterior in the pokey. Good going, gumshoe. But a few of Carmen's vultures are still flying loose. Oh. And I've got another case for you if you want it. What do you say? I say, I want a new case. Let's go, Chief! <laughs> They're frantic in France because the gargoyles are gone. <gasps> in Paris, Notre Dame Cathedral has stood for centuries with its gruesome gargoyles carved into the front to ward off evil. But now, evil can waltz right in until you get the greedy grubber who grabbed the gargoyles. Wait, if, Go the, get em. if the gargoyles keep evil out... So you think you can stop my schemes? You've proven yourself to be a good detective, detective. But no one can catch Carmen San Diego. If the gargoyles are supposed to keep evil out, how is evil able to get in and steal them? Vol 707. Parle pour la France. Bon voyage. That's okay, they just, they stole the gargoyles because they wanted to make Hunchback of Notre Dame a better movie. Hello, can I be of service? 
Yeah, where did they go? She was training on horseback so that she could improve. Okay, we're going to Canada. Eh? She's altitudinally challenged. Okay, she's a shorty. No, I want to talk to you, bro. Hi there. Her height wasn't ideal for basketball, but perfect for miniature golf. Ha uh ha -huh. Emergency room report. With the help of our new laser scalpel, we were able to remove some old gum from the patient's chestnut hairdo. The bald spot should grow out soon. Chestnut hairdo? Chestnuts are brown, right? What can I help you with? Yeah, tell me about the suspect. Her mocha-colored hair looked dyed. It's because it was, because it's a wig. Hello, stranger. Her hair was the color of dirt. Okay, now everyone's telling me what her hair color was. What's going on? I took a peek. Everyone's like, she had brown hair. I remember that, and only that. <laughs> oh, and she was short. Alright, where's Dudley do right? Horse, I lost control! Do you need some help? Where'd they go? She said the name of the island country and the name of the capital city of her oh, destination that's, um, were the same. It's either Singapore or Indonesia. She wore a mini Big Ben on her wrist. Cool, she has a watch. Yes, what is it? She's definitely not going to take the watch off when we get to the she location. She seems to have a habit of throwing her weight around and... Okay. She is fat. Cool. Alright, it's Singapore. I remember that clue. There are a lot of potential clues for each country you can go to, but because there are 40 cases, you will eventually run into repeats. Oh no! What would it be like to get all the color sucked out of you? Hello. If she can't find a fishing boat going north to Vladivostok, she'll be stuck for now in the port of Kangnang on the Sea of Japan. Is that just Russia? It's not Russia, but it's South Korea. Because that's like the only thing near the Sea of Japan right here. <laughs> Oh no! That's why you don't bring that powerful of a magnet, bro. Hello there. Where did the suspect go, she didn't bro? Just go to the Maghreb, meaning the West. She went to an area known as the farthest West. Okay, interesting. What are our options? I think that's Australia, right? I mean, hmm. My guess is Australia, but I'll get a, a few more clues first. Oh, hi. She's probably now waking up in Ajadir to the cry of a muezzin calling from a minaret. Okay, maybe it's not Australia. Good day. She's hiding in the nation surrounding Ceuta. No, it's not Australia. Glad I didn't go there. What's going on? She's trying to catch her wind in a land where the Siracos often roar in from the Sahara through the <laughs> Okay, okay. To the coast. All right, it's somewhere in Africa then. All right. Definitely glad I did not just randomly decide to fly off to. Uh... I think we're going to Morocco. Yeah, that's the right one. Yeah, I could get behind a backyard baseball TV show. I'm not sure if I would watch it at this point, but I think that would be a hit with kids. <laughs> Farthest West, excluding the uh, other continent known as Americas. <laughs> Walk away, bro. I don't what want you in mean? here. She was feeling bullish about a run through the streets of Pamplona. Is that just Spain? Yeah. Running of the bulls. Only a two-hour flight. Back here, baseball, it would just be a show about the kids and their adventures.
I think the Backyard series does work better as a game, though. May I help you? She flagged down a fellow wearing red Horachi sandals, a green poncho, and a white sombrero. So, Mexico. <laughs> Man, these clues are easy. Or maybe I'm smarter than I thought. <laughs> the Ricky Johnson episode would just be he's shy and nice. Alright, she has brown hair, short, fat watch. Oh, that's her. Hi there, what's up? What's up? Not you, because you're going down! Get her, Granny! <laughs> Lisa Carr captured! <laughs> oh, these puns are so dumb, but they're also this so great! tired me out. But Carmen's in the driver's seat, and you'll never match her speed. I don't know about that. <laughs> I was just reading about your success. You've done an excellent job. Thanks to you, Lisa Carr can't even rent a bike. <laughs> the only thing she'll be driving is a pair of prison issue sneakers. Oh, I har use that's more harsh. Of your superb skills right now. There's been another crime. Do you want to take the case? Harsh, but that's what she gets for stealing the gargoyles. They were important characters in Hunchback and Notre Dame, kind of, not really, actually. Yes, I would like a new case. They're they rowdy did? in Saudi Arabia, Gumshoe, because someone stole the middle of the Trans-Arabian pipeline. Oh, uh, that's bad. Millions of gallons of crude are stuck in one place till you get that hunk of pipe back. So head out. Uh, and try to keep the sand from scratching up your spyglass. Well, thank goodness that the oil's not leaving the pipes. I just wanted to congratulate you on your promotion to detective. I'd love to stay and chat, but I've got a fabulous theft to commit. Great. Are we sure that Carmen's crook stole the pipeline and that it wasn't destroyed in one of the many wars? Oh wait, this was before the whole war in the Middle East. That 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 dates it. <laughs> Okay, I, I will try. Terry Queen actually had uh, backyard baseball toys. That's kind of impressive. And I assume you were meaning Dairy Queen and not Diary King. Hey there. Hey ya. She said that she was off to the homeland of a prince who was a main character in the Merchant of Venice. I should know this because I took a Shakespeare class multiple years, but I can't remember. I think Italy? For someone her age, her height was pretty typical. All right. Very average. Hi there. She was hoping to make a mint selling mint-flavored tea bags in a North African country where tea is the national drink. It's not Italy, okay. In terms of height, she was neither a Colossus nor a Lilliputian. All right, I already knew she was very... very yes, yeah, she had a very average What's height. What's on your mind? I hear the police trailed her through the streets of Saki, but she lost them on a moped in the Medina. Mm-hmm. <laughs> she had a hairdo the color of a thundercloud. Cool, gray hair. You don't see that very often. No, black! In a really big storm at night! <laughs> oh, yes. She said that she was dying to see the blue man of the Sahara. <laughs> uh, the, the game is made for kids, so uh, I don't think they would get away with she that. She probably never gets teased about her height. Do you get teased about your... I don't want to talk about it. Can I be of assistance? A coiffure of steel sat atop... That's a million dollar word. Do, 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 do. Okay, so we go into Morocco. Hey, Recess was a great show, and I have not seen it, but I've heard it. Hey Arnold was a great show as well, so. Back when people cared about making kids' shows actually good, and not just talk down to them. Man, you'd think after he got his hands trapped in that dumpster like 20 times, he would eventually not trust his partner to hold it open. Hello, may I be... She said, let them eat cake. We're going and to France. She wore spectacular spectacles. And she's got glasses. Gotta know how fat she is, though. It's always the, it's always the weight. Do you need some? She was sporting spit... Okay, everyone here notices that... Okay, 
Okay, here we go. Middle of the road waistlines. Average weight. That's why no one was commenting. Boom. All right, wee oui, wee oui, mon ami. We going to France. Only a three and a half hour plane flight from Morocco to France. I keep forgetting how condensed the Europe area is. Well, hello. I bet she's stopping to smell the protea, the country's national flower in Cape Province. I don't know who that is. Oh, hello. It must be the pits, but she's holed up in an old diamond mine in Kimberley. Mm-hmm. Again, not Why, ringing hello. any bells. She's feeling lethargic in Lesotho due to the high altitude. Okay, high altitude. That can narrow it down. Okay, let's see. I don't think it would be Hungary. I don't think it would be Thailand or Cambodia. Probably not South Africa. Would it be Guatemala? Okay, I'm gonna have to pull out the map for this. Okay, Lesotho, Kimberley, Cape Province. Yeah, these 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 are some tough clues now. Good afternoon. She's gone to see if the Orange River is really orange. This is yeah. This is gonna take my. Uh... Yes, she just called from Gauteng, where grass on the veldt grows tall near the Vol. Okay. Okay, I don't think it's Guatemala because none of these words seem Spanish. Okay, let me look up the geography of Hungary. Maybe Hungary is more elevated than I thought. Oh, it is pretty elevated. Okay, there are mi there's mining here. It's not really a river, though, so I don't know if the Orange River would be there. Lesotho. Lesotho, Kimberley, Cape Province. You can also search for stuff in here, so like I could look up like Veld to see if it appears anywhere, but that takes fuel. Hmm. The talking translator. Oh, that's that's actually really cool. I didn't know you could do this. So that'll help you for the uh, Robocrook stuff. Internet. Oh, do you actually? Wow, you can literally connect to the internet if you want here. I don't know what that does, but that's kind of interesting. Glossary. Oh, that's cool. I did not know about all of this stuff. That's kind of interesting. Location music? Yes, I want that. Why would you not want that on? Character speed. This is interesting. Don't mind me, I'm just busy trying not to make a mistake. Okay, should we check Cam Let's check Cambodia and Thailand? Okay, I don't think it's Cambodia. Let's check Thailand. No, that doesn't seem to be a diver. What the heck? These clues are terrible. Okay, hang on. Protea. National flower Protea. Will that be listed somewhere? I mean, they exist. Not particularly clever, but, I mean, I don't have an issue with them. <sighs> this is ridiculous. Okay, I, you know what? Oh, we haven't looked up South Africa yet. Hang on. It is just freaking South Africa. Oh, it's freaking South Africa. <laughs> Do -do 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 -do.
That took me a very long time to figure out, but I got there. Hey there. Hey ya. She was humming God save the queen as she waited for the shuttle. Cool, cool, cool. After after that last set of clues, we needed an easy one. <laughs> Go into the United Kingdom. You call that? <laughs> well, I I didn't say it was a good song. Do, 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 Hello, do. Strange. She planned to visit an outdoor market in Tabriz, which she heard was a bizarre spot. Oh, I love the pun. It's great. Do 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 do. Hey there. I pumped her for information, but her unrefined answer only suggested a crude plan to visit oil wells near Awaz. Okay, somewhere where there's bazaars what and oil mean? that could describe a they bunch of different countries. This slick operation has a certain OPEC nation over a barrel. Again, not really giving me any new information. Hi there, what's up? She's acting crooked in the Strait of Hormuz. That gives me a little more to go off of. Do you need information? I do, as a matter She's of fact. She's studying the mosque architecture in Abaddon in search of Islam's fire. Again, again this could describe any number of Middle Eastern countries. I believe it. Okay, well, it's Iran. <laughs> Thankfully, the pos. Oh, it's still playing the. Uh, it's still playing "God Save the Queen" in the background. <laughs> now it's changing. No, what? You can't do that. I was at the end of the case, though. <laughs> Oh no! It just flat out kicked me out. <laughs> Apparently, it was playing the uh, the UK music in the background while playing the play music, and the game did not like that. And it just is like, you're, yeah, you're out. Wow. Okay. I guess Carmen wins the. <laughs> you win this time, Carmen San Diego. <laughs> but next week, I'll be back. <laughs>